You know what? I'm gonna say it. I'm tired of people calling this mantra fucking bad. I'm tired of people calling this mantra mid. The metal turret. That's what we're talking about today. Or I guess I'm showing off. Like, what even is this video I'm doing? Like, I've had videos planned, I've had videos prepped, but clearly that's not what I want to make. So I'm just redoing it from the start and just deciding, you know what, instead of making a ramble on why fucking metal turret's good, why don't I just show y'all? This turret, metal turret, is really good once you modify it. Like, a lot of mantras. Sure, the base form might not be the best. Sure, it may not be the best for your 10,000... Iron Sing Gale Breath c combo build. Because that's not what it's made for. It's used for area denial and unironically being a really goddamn amazing PvE tool. Because guess what? Monsters follow you. And since most monsters can't parry, can you guess what happens when the turret locks onto them? Please spawn here. Thank you. Get one of these. Most of that damage was metal turrets. Like, genuinely. Like... Really? Oh yeah, y'all have even seen the best use of it. Is it useful in every single situation? No, absolutely not. It's probably not gonna be the best against brood lords or frickin' squibbos with their whole frickin' Ooh, I'm gonna glow blue so that way you can't frickin' predictor. It's not useful in every situation. It's a situational mantra, but when, those si when the situation is met, holy hell, it performs really well. Who would have guessed? Like, I know I'm sounding mad, but genuinely, I just, like, want people to stop calling this mantra bad or mid just because it's not the best for PvP. And even then, it's decent at PvP. Is it the absolute best mantra? Are you gonna pick it up for every single situation? No, because again, 10,000 combo builds exist. They are annoying to fight, and they know how to counter turrets. They just move out of the way of your turret's range and then hit you with ranged attacks. Is this mantra probably going to be nerfed? Probably. But honestly, I don't see it getting nerfed that hard because it's not that bad in PvP scenarios. The only time it's really busted is in PvE scenarios when the right scenarios are met. AKA, you needing to always dodge. Because if you parry at your opponent's attack, to bada bing bada boom, guess what's going to happen? You're freaking opponent enters some weird auto parry frames where all of the bullets that are supposed to hit parry instead. Just something that's gonna be have to be dealt with. I don't know, I'm just rambling. I have a fan on so I'm sorry if you can hear that, but just like I needed to talk about this. Or rather I needed to show it off, because just like Narrating a clip doesn't do this justice. I... You need the live reaction. You need the live showcase of how good this mantra is. It also gives me time to practice my editing. <laughs> We're entering new era of Starry Z, baby. But, um, yeah, what really baffles me recently is just, like... This new mantra gets released. It's a turret. It's obviously not gonna be the best mantra for every situation, but it's a cool mantra. And then the first thing people say when they see videos of it or talk about it is like, oh, this is mid, this is bad, this is not that good. Like, shut up! Alright, here we are at Chaser. Spit. Give me that. Bada bing, bada boom. Where's the first one? Here. Roll. Bada bing, bada boom. Second one. Bada bing, bada boom. Third one. Jump jump, break, and then we place this here. Okay, probably could have placed it in a better spot, but honestly, it's not that bad. It still got, it still got the job done. I'll take it. God, I am fearful of the cure scar when we get there. <laughs> How much time do I have left on the blade? 13 minutes? I could do 13. I command the 13 to do this. Metal Rain. Oh, 
Are we doing this in two cycles or are we doing it in three? Two cycles, baby! God damn it, let's go! Could I have. Should I have done it without using Metal Rain, Oxidizing Rush, and all that? Yeah, probably. Maybe it would shut off the damage better. But honestly, freaking. My goal is to show off the big guy, the big guy at the end of the run. Freaking Etheron, Void Spire, let's take that. Let's go down the floor too, baby. Also, th I'm just recording this just so I can show people, yes, I have in fact beat Etheron with this move. Am I going to use only this move? No, but I feel like if you play Deep Woken for a long time, you'll be able to tell that this is doing quite a lot of damage. People saying this mantra is mid is pissing me off. Because it's not that bad. It's not that mid. People are just complaining that it's not working well with their PvP uh, build. And I know they said that a million times, but it's just like, it's true. Alright, let's do this. So, I really hope I did the edit I'm thinking in my head here. Because if not, I'm going to be very disappointed in myself. Come on, we need to put more effort in video star. Come on, step it up, man. Oh yeah, for people wondering why I have Astral on a gun, it's because it annoys people, and I like annoying people in this game. It's really funny. Just because people are overly toxic in this game, and then seeing Astral on a gun is just... Hilarious. Uh, like you on God. Okay, so like the thing that's really hilarious to me about like all these complaints is like they never say why they think it's mid or why they think it's bad. They just like they look at it and say mid. Like give it a chance, man. Holy hell. Like it's genuinely hilarious to me how fast people just like judge a book by its cover don't they know the saying don't judge a book by its cover it's like one of the oldest sayings in the book man right here bada boom, bada boom. dodge this one always gives me trouble there we go I'm going to ignore you guys cuz like I don't wanna Ooh. Okay. And we need to go left? It was not left. It was not left. It was not left. It was right. It was right. I'm dumb. I'm stupid. It was right. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. They are all... You know, I'm just gonna pop this here. That worked! <laughs> Jesus Christ, that worked a little too well. Alright, now I gotta deal with two more, but without my metal turret. Ugh. Go here, pop a turret. God! Metal turret's really coming in clutch. I still have my light hook, so I, I would have been safe, but it's just like... You know, I'd rather not die here. This is clearly showing how well I am at the game, how amazing I am at Deep Woken. I know, truly, my way of playing is baffling to y'all because of how effortlessly I handled that situation. All right, get ready. It's gonna be real embarrassing if I die here.
Okay, I can make it. 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 Alright, come on. Come on, shoot bones at me. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, that's that's no bueno. Still got it. Go on, throw bones at me. Throw bones at me. You know you want to. That's not bones. I said throw bones. Come on, dude. Thank you. I should probably do is I should... Should I grab a health pack? Nah. I will grab this though. Okay, you missed. Okay, 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 okay. Etheron, I'm trying to one cycle you here. Oh, it's on the complete opposite tip. <laughs> Truly shows how aware I am at the game. And now. Ooh. Sun's in a pillar. It, you know, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Just plop military here, metal rain. What did I tell y'all? Where's the exit? Okay, there it is, there it is. Let's see if I get anything good. Come on, please, please tell me I get something good from this apart from bragging rights that I beat Etheron with Metal Turret. Come on. Delver's Duster, Railblade. Uh, sure. Yeah, I'll take, I'll, I'll take it, it's something. It's something, you know, it's not... It's not like an amazing card or something that's coming to a really cool card game that I like or anything, but, but I'll take it, sure, why not? Now it's time for the scary part where I have to escape. I just realized I have two rail blades and rail blade and double just I would have preferred the freaking legendary that would have given me Duke Shield. I've been trying to get that for a while. That that would be fun to use. Like really freaking fun.
Okay, now here comes the scary part. Freaking four Kierce guards. Because we needed more of these. Oh, oh, woo! Hey! Okay, uh, to the right. Uh, they're right behind me! Hey! Die. And that's me beating Etheron with metal turret. This recording is literally 26 minutes long. Jesus. <laughs>